It's Weston, and I am here in Denver, Colorado. I'm at some park. This is my little van right here. Wa -ba -ba -ba. I've been in Denver for, for probably what? About about a week. I got here Sunday. It's about to be Sunday soon. So far, I'm really enjoying Denver, honestly. I really like it, especially for a, you know a big city. I've been having a good time. Nothing, nothing too crazy, but I've been having a pretty relaxed, decent time compared to some other cities I've been to. For example, San Diego and Los Angeles. Uh, yeah, I'm enjoying it, but this video is going to be about parking here in Denver. What has my experience has been so far this week in parking? Uh, I did spend like two nights on my brother's couch. With all the other nights, I've just been parking in random places. So far though, it's been so easy, so easy to find parking. That's right guys, if you wanna to come to Denver, Colorado, you'll find street parking. There is streets, upon streets, and overnight parking everywhere. I've seen a handful of RVs and bigger rigs, but when it comes to, like for example, my little Chevy Astro, I blend right in with every other vehicle and I'm not really worried. It, so where I've been hanging out in Denver has been kind of like the downtown area. I found an awesome coffee shop called, I think St. Mark's Coffee Shop. It's open till 12 at night. Wi-Fi is awesome. Uh, it's a cool, cool hip crowd, some beautiful people. It's a nice atmosphere to be around. There's a bar right next door. And so I've been hanging around the downtown area and also uh, this is a Glen the Glendale area, which is kind of like south, East Denver or whatever and that's where the anytime fitness is I'm going and I found some parking right near nearby so I just park on the street and go straight to anytime fitness uh, I parked near the apartment complexes near my brother where I just like park outside of apartment complexes I'm fine I parked out near some random buildings that just have overnight parking there's, there's so much room so much room there's also lots of construction going on and there's plenty of parking I found near a lot of the construction sites and I've seen some RVs parked near the, some of the construction sites just like just like it's normal street parking but I feel I feel better about parking near some big building or or, or construction site because I'm not parked right outside of someone's living area you know what I mean I don't know I, I don't I don't usually park outside of actual houses or neighborhoods apartment complexes are okay but I still try to to be like across the street from an apartment complex. But I don't know, I don't like being directly near someone's living area. I just don't wanna make them feel weird. You know what I'm saying? But guys, it's been easy. You're gonna have an easy time. You no know worries. Everything's open. So basically, I'm, I'm really digging Denver. The parking situation's been super easy. It's everywhere, it's a nice city. Um, what I, right now, my mind always changes, but right now I do wanna spend another couple weeks here and see, try to go out and make friends, kinda of like what I did in Flagstaff. Literally, how I got involved with some people in Flagstaff was I literally went out and walked up to people and said, hey, hey, hey. And by doing that, I made connections and worlds, doors opened up to worlds like, oh my God. Oh my God, the things, the experiences I have experienced in Flagstaff, Arizona, from like crazy forest parties to dancing out in Sedona to, to cra just crazy shit. And it was from just me being alone in my van and walking, walking up to people and, and just saying, hey, what's up, you know? Hey, hey, what's up? People are nice, especially if you're willing to be open. It's scary and intimidating. I still am getting anxiety right now thinking about it. Just because going out alone is intimidating. What's freaking cool though is there's no reason, there is no reason I should be scared. There's no reason anybody should be scared to talk to people, to, to be free, to be free, to be unstifled. And what's cool about traveling around is especially traveling around. I, you know, I've noticed is you think, you think, you know, oh, I'll go to a different city and you know, I'll be, no one will know me and then I can just be crazy and do whatever the hell I want, right? No. I mean, that's, that's definitely a possibility, but you still carry these, you still carry these patterns of thought 
and anxiety in your body. So you still carry it with you destination to destination whether people know you or not. It's still with you. So it's still up to you. Uh, so what I've realized is traveled around, I'm, oh, I'm still fairly socially anxious. And guys, don't take me out of context. I'm not, I don't have like crazy social problems. I actually consider myself fairly, fairly, fairly well socially. Um, I used to be terrible, but I did a little bit of work and hey, I like being a little bit scared. It gives you something to work on, something something exciting. So, if you're thinking about going to Denver, Colorado, you're not gonna have too many issues parking. I, I mean, I know I've only been here for like a week, but I don't see, see myself having too many issues. And it's been easy finding street parking everywhere. And hey, and it's a pretty chill, it feels like a pretty chill city. I, I'm, I'm digging the vibe. There's. I'm digging it. I've been here. I've been here a handful of times, but it's totally different situation when you're living in a van. I'm traveling around in my home in the streets. <clears throat> so if you guys are thinking to come to Denver, Colorado, do it. It's freaking awesome. <laughs> but guys, I hope you like my video. I'll be posting some more videos. Let me know. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you've had any experiences out here. Let me know if you know any places I should check out. And thank you guys for watching. Please be sure to like, comment, subscribe. Uh, thank you. I'm having a blast. I'm having a blast out here. I do miss my fly, fly, Flagstaff fam. You know, having a little posse. But it's good. It's good to change areas. It's good to, to shift perspectives. It's good to go away from what, you, what you're used to and then to come back. It's all good. It's all good. But guys, I feel pretty good right now. I feel pretty good right now. I hope you guys are feeling good. I hope you guys are having a good day. And I'm having kind of fun making these videos. Uh, this, yeah, I don't know. But thank you guys. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe. Uh, later guys.